Ed Sheeran has proved he's still just a normal guy as he headed to his local curry house for a post-gig meal after performing for the Queen on the weekend. The millionaire singer and songwriter had built up an appetite after performing to millions on stage at Buckingham Palace for the Platinum Jubilee concert. The 31-year-old popped to his local Indian after he dropped up at the palace and ordered his favorite dish, a 9 pounds and 55 pence paneer tikka chili masala, with rice and mince, from Cafe India near his home in Framlingham, Suffolk. The star, who has just become a dad for the second time, phoned his order through and was asked to collect it in person by the restaurant manager Bell Almenta who said he knows Ed sometimes sends someone else to pick it up. Bell all claims Ed is a long-standing and loyal customer, who orders a takeaway from Cafe India between 10 to 15 times a year and has done for more than a decade. He is a regular customer for more than 10 years, he loves our curry, and he is very, very friendly, Mr. Minta said. He added, we are so proud of him, if you saw him face to face you'd never realize he is a superstar if you don't know him. From the beginning in September 2008, not only he comes but his missus, mum, dad and they all come regularly and eat in the restaurant. I saw on BBC News he said he was going home to see his daughter and have a curry after his jubilee performance. I was thinking he will come here. When he called, I asked him if he can come and pick up the curry as sometimes he doesn't come himself. He said it was no problem and came down and was happy for pictures. But he said he was very tired and left afterwards, he took his curry and go. Bilal said what he loves about Ed is that he doesn't change a single thing since becoming famous, and claims that he still spends time with his childhood friends. He dedicated a beautiful rendition of his song Perfect to the Queen and her late husband Prince Philip. Videos of the monarch and her family played on huge screens behind Dead as he sang.